So Nigeria has recorded an improved ranking in the Corruption Perception Index, moving five places up to rank 145 out of 180 countries assessed. According to the latest Corruption Index released by Transparency International, the country also gained one point added to its previous 24, ending up scoring 25 out of the 100 maximum points in the 2023 CPI results, apart from moving five places up from its 150th position. Arguably the most widely used global corruption ranking in the world, the CPI measures how corrupt each country's public sector is perceived to be. The Civil Society Legislative Advocacy Center, which presented the index in Abuja, said Nigeria's score is below the sub-Saharan African average of 33 points. The index revealed that Nigeria scored 25 out of 100 points in 2023 Corruption Perception Index compared to 24 points in the year 2022. Corruption Perception Index, uh, while Nigeria ranks 145 out of uh, 180 countries, compared to 150 on the 2022 Corruption Perception Index results. Um, it's no longer news again that what we know as a cliche is what to cut. Um, we don't know if our votes will count or will count in the future, or the courts will decide our ballots. Um, but this is this calls for concern on the review of the Electoral Act. The poor performance of the election fails to justify the huge resources allocated to INEC for the conduct of the elections. Again, it's no longer news if INEC conducts free, fair, and credible elections, or we just say we conduct elections. These times, we don't know if elections are free, we don't know if it is fair or if it is correct. The anti-corruption agencies also need to provide information on data on their arrests, investigations, and prosecutions, especially of politically exposed persons and high-profile individuals, as well as give information on the proceeds of crime they recover in line with the Proceeds of Crime Management Act 2022. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.